Hey, what is up, hello guys? Hi, it's Yunga. Welcome back to my channel. It is Sunday night. It is the first week of the second half of the semester. I hope that made sense. And I just decided to vlog because I start a new class this week, whereas in the past two semesters, my eight-week courses have been in the first half. So that's going to be interesting because it's like an added workload versus like a decreased workload. It's for principles of ABA. I also have a presentation tomorrow for UNIV. I was supposed to have two um, and we pushed back the other one to Friday. But tomorrow's presentation is on window registration because that's coming up and we do it ourselves so I have to make sure the students know what to do. So I already made my presentation for that and sent it over to my professor. It's 8 o'clock, so I'm gonna start getting ready to leave for class now. So my presentation today went okay. I haven't presented in like about a month, just because a good chunk of the presentations that I wanted to do as a peer leader with the curriculum and everything just like really fit in with like the first month of the semester. I also just like made a like mid-semester update post on my speechy Instagram account, which here is what it looks like. The last post I made was like the num like which classes I'm taking and that was at the very beginning of the semester. But part of it too is because like there's really nothing interesting to post about that's speech related. Whenever it's like the first day type of thing, I don't have the best appetite. So I don't necessarily feel like eating. Let me get a Plus I'm gonna be such a like hangry person if I like go into a two hour lecture without any food in my system. Like I can attend it through Zoom, but with how the class is looking, just content wise, I don't think that would be the smartest move on my part, especially cause like I am on campus. So I do have the option of like showing up in person. I don't know. I'm the only one in the classroom right now. I mean, I'm ten, like eight minutes early, but you know, it's like the paranoia of am I in the right classroom, which I checked, and is anybody else going to be here? So it's like 3.40 now. I've been back in my apartment for a little bit. I obviously got Einstein's on the way back, um, just because like I didn't really have like a solid lunch. And I like I typically try to get Einstein's after phonetics since I'm already in DeSantis, but I think they changed their operating hours, so they're usually closed by the time I leave phonetics. There were literally just two of us in the classroom earlier with a professor. It was funny too, because I was the only one there first, and so I got paranoid, because like what if the professor is just teaching from home, so like there's really no point in going there. But then the professor came, and then we had another student come in. And then there were like a few students who didn't realize they could come into the classroom today so they said they'd be like in the classroom eventually so that's great um but yeah definitely need to drink coffee before i head to that class because as soon as we reach like the halfway point i could feel myself just like dozing off so i'm gonna try and make like banana chocolate chip cookies so here's the first like dozen of this thing um it's really good i'm probably gonna do my chapter work for the week in bio because you know so i mean i checked it earlier and it only had 50 questions so it shouldn't be too bad it's 11 50 and i'm in bed but felt like i needed to point out the fact that my ra sent in a code for among us in the group chats i played like two rounds of them so it's 9 25 in the morning now i've been up for like about an hour and a half and today is more of like uh not really a work day but like meetings and other things i guess like notes but nothing like homework related normally i do bio stuff on tuesdays but i ended up doing that last night so really the only thing i have going on today are a bunch of meetings so i have a linkedin workshop for peer leader that's in about half an hour um and then i have another meeting at noon and then a cohort meeting for peer leaders still at 5 30 today 
so that's what's really going on so it's about 15 minutes before we start i have my computer set up and everything and i'm waiting for my coffee to cool down a bit so so that's over now but i think my zoom was acting up because i would unmute myself but like the mic wasn't picking anything up hi <laughs> to be a mess so our meeting got cancelled so we're just figuring out what to do now yeah it's like almost nine now. Uh, I need to read chapter two before my ABA class tomorrow. I did have one more language science quiz that I haven't done yet and I might retake the other one that I took yesterday. I don't think I'm gonna do well on any of those tonight so I'm just gonna wait until tomorrow to do those. Okay, so one of my things for this new class that has me really worried is just like how lengthy all um, the chapters are starting to look like and like my professor was telling us yesterday like oh just remember this is like a 3000 level course some like peer leader stuff for tomorrow's class so i had to print something out and then i'm just replying back to an email right now i just need to know why i thought it would be a good idea to minor well i know why i decided to minor in aba but it's like i do be having a lot of faith in myself because i fully remember struggling with Respondent and operant conditioning in AP Psych. AP Psych. And I had a good AP Psych teacher too. Wow. It's a little bit past 8 now and I'm gonna start getting ready. in person lol i am back at my apartment for the next two and a half hours made myself some iced coffee like always so it's a little bit past 12 i actually ended up doing both of the quizzes i needed to do for language science my apartment's like 312 now and I can't wait to change into my pangbalay and surprisingly during principles of ABA I did not find myself dozing off at any point of the discussion the two-hour lecture um, which was good and I actually was like understanding what we were talking about which is amazing um, there's just one part where I was like I was listening to my professor and then he like called on me to answer the question and then I just completely blinked because like the question didn't process so I had to ask him to like repeat the question it was just like reading this definition off the book but I was just like could you repeat that please I really 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 I really 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 don't want to do stuff right now but I'm gonna do my phonetics notes because central vowels and stress sounds, word stress levels, I don't like those. many definitions in our notes from last week but apparently we did so and 
another Wednesday, another 9 p.m. Zoom call. This is actually the first time I'm attending this class on my kitchen island, which I probably would have been in my bed if I went back to my room. So I'm like, no, I gotta stay here. But I think I'm caffeinated enough to not fall asleep. You need to do more than that is extra credit. Right. Okay. Forgot about that. Uh, what? It was just midterm. I didn't start that yet. <laughs> uh oh. I completely forgot we um, had that project too. Yeah. So I'm finally out of that lecture. Now it's just like, do, do I do notes? Like, do I go to bed early? Like, I don't have a class in the morning tomorrow, so I don't really have to go to sleep. It's almost 10 and I finally like got dressed and stuff. Class is it until 3, but we need to get out of bed um, and go over spent triple vowels again. I'm just so bad with like um, noticing stress and intonation in words. I mean, I'm glad we don't have to like transcribe then like we don't do narrow transcription in class because my professor was like, well, you don't really need to. Um, but my main thing is like <laughs> stress versus unstressed because satchel vowels are stressed or unstressed. It's yeah. So this is what I have so far with my um, academic timeline presentation for tomorrow. I have to make sure I figure that out by tonight so I can email it to my professor, but I mean, yeah. So I'm back in my apartment now and I'm kind of feeling a little bit of time pressure now because I decided to kind of redo what I've already done for my academic timeline presentation for tomorrow just because I wasn't really liking how the first one was looking and it was easier to just start from scratch so that's what i'm doing right now this is also my last unit presentation so it's a little bit bittersweet oh and i'm towards the end of my presentation i'm just wrapping up my conclusion page because this one i'm inserting another photo in oh i also already sent my slides to my professor while i was on zoom with my cousin and so that's done and over with um yeah so i'm gonna start getting ready for the rest of the night um, so it's like a little darker than usual for 8.30 in the morning. I really hope it doesn't rain. Look at my living room. It's dark. It's dark. Ugh. I'm really not liking where that whole thing is going. But it's whatever, at least it's Friday. back because I had a cohort meeting at six. It was the one that was supposed to be on Tuesday and then it got moved. So cohort ended about 20 minutes ago and I've just been spending the last 20 minutes posting on the canvas for this one flyer that we just got that, is, that the students need to like get access to and then also drafting and sending out this email about the whole like winter registration thing because OIIT decided that they were gonna update it right before winter registration and like not tell us so we couldn't like change our presentations um, to fit that. So I've just sent them an email. Hopefully they're like, this is where you go. For winter registration, it might look a little different. In case you haven't seen that email, here's the link to the video, but hopefully they see that. But that's beyond my control now. So I think this is where I'm gonna end my video because I am about to go and figure out dinner, but I hope you guys enjoyed 
this a week long vlog give it a thumbs up if you did comment down below what you think subscribe to my channel for more and i'll see you guys in my next one bye